What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel or if you're new, welcome to my channel. My name is Bianca. Um, if you don't know, and I'm Bianca Sanchez on Instagram. Um, but today, uh, don't mind the, the toys back there. My, those are my daughter's toys, so don't mind those. But today has finally come for me to show you how I do my DIY nails. So you hear noises in the background, don't mind them. They're my kids playing, my two daughters playing. If you would like to subscribe to my channel, subscribe so you don't miss you know, any of my videos. And if you want to click that notification bell, go ahead and click it. Okay, click it, click it, click it, click it. All right, anyways, let's get in. So the first thing that you're gonna need are these nails. Um, I got this off Amazon. I will look for them and link them down below. They had on the, you know, so many different shapes and sizes. I like mine to be long, so you know, these are gonna be long coffin. And then I also got all my rhinestones from uh, Amazon too. Well, first of all, the way that I got this idea to do these, uh, DIY nails is I got them from got the idea from Tina Halata here on YouTube. If she ever sees this, what's up, girl? I'm, I'm pretty sure she probably won't, but she does. Who knows? To use this glue right here, you can get it at Target. Come on, come on, focus. It's yeah, that glue. But yeah, so let's just kind of get into it, and obviously the color that you want. So let's get into it. So you're first gonna wanna you know dump out all dump these out and then you're gonna want to find your sizes I mean these are pretty explanatory so I'm I'll show you really fast like how I do my nails so I just did one so let me do the rest of them and I will probably just forward this part but yeah you're just, you're just gonna basically do the same thing So this is how they will look when you're done, you know, nice and clear. And I forgot to say that uh, you could probably file your actual nails a little bit, just so that the super glue can, you know, stick on a little better. Um, but yeah, so this is how it looks. And now we're just going to paint, paint them. Um, I'm gonna use this color. I've always wanted to do neon orange, and then I just want to see if I'm gonna like it. And the good thing is, if I don't like it wear it for like a week and then just switch it up. Okay, so we are back. Don't mind the screaming in the background. My girls are getting crazy. I'm gonna take you from this, okay, to this girl. You are gonna be rocking your nails. So, to get started, like I told you, I got these jewels from uh, Amazon. These came together in one package and these two came separately. So I'm just gonna do, um, I just wanted to do one hand just for like time. Hopefully this is a good view, this is as far as zoomed in as I can get, um, as I can get the camera to be. So I'm just hoping that it's a good view. So like I said, I have the paint one, um, the paint super glue here. And I think that is the quickest and the best because I used the squeezy one before and it just gets annoying when you have to keep on squeezing it out and then sometimes it pours too much out. And it's almost like if you're just painting your nails again. So, And you can get this at Target. I got this at Target. Um, the other super glue I got at Target too. So, you know, I'm, I'm pretty sure Walmart too. I think I've seen this at Walmart too. So let's get started. I'm going to do the thumb. And you're just brushing it on like if you're doing a little note. And only put the super glue where you're gonna put your um, rhinestones. And I get it like this, and I put it here. Oops, I think I got the bigger one. Oh well, that's fine. All right, we'll just work with it. And then we're gonna put two little ones on the side. I hope that this is working for you guys. 
I'm trying to, you know, do the best ang angles I can. See that? And you just pick them up with the tweezers and kind of just place them on there. Oh, oh no. Uh, see, I didn't put enough glue right there. Like I said, I'm no professional, okay? I'm since we're going to do a big rhinestone, I'm going to do like a good amount of glue. And then just grab it with the tweezers. And then just put it here. If you have that little pin that the rhinestones stick to, then that would be ideal because it would just be so much quicker. how I do it guys and yeah so like I said I will link everything everything down below well I guess I'll link the nails and the rhinestones down below okay down there And there you have it, you guys. Just like that. You have a full set of nails. Look at that. Yes. I accidentally put the smaller um, rhinestones on this one and not the ones um, bigger than, than them, but that's okay. So there you have it. You got your full set of nails that looks like you spent, you know, $70, $80, but so yeah, you guys, there you go. Um, that's usually how I do my DIY acrylic rhinestone nails. Don't they look? Oh, I love the way they come out. Yes. And you can always, you know, they have colorful rhinestones, you know, all those colors and all that. You can make different color nails, um, you know, all that. So um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Now it just look, now it looks like you spent, you know, $80 or more on your nails when really you only spent like technically it's maybe like I don't know three dollars for a nail set because of how cheap everything was you know so yeah like I said I will link everything down below and I got enjoyed this video and um, if you did give it a thumbs up and please remember to subscribe if you want to but you should. My other videos, I think it's like gonna be right, one of these right here. One of, you know, one of this click, one of these right here. But um, yeah, so I will see you guys later.